Hello Lola's. Welcome back to my channel guys. So I'm here with baby Joey and I decided to go ahead and keep him as Joey because I've been calling him that since I saw him. Um, it is a funny little story behind him but <laughs> some people might be upset about the story behind him so I'm not going to really go into it too much. All I can say is that that one picture with him with the plaid little shirt on it just reminded me of the profile of Joe from the movie You. So, um, of course, I'm not going to give him such a dark personality. Well, Joe don't have really a dark personality. He doesn't like to see people do bad things. Okay? Um, but anyway, we're going to have fun with him. Um, I wanted to take the time to sit down and just share this moment. I love him with a pacifier too. I don't know why. I love him without and I love him. It's like I don't want to cover his beautiful lips. But then it's like oh my gosh he's just so cute with his pacifier. He just looked like he would be a baby that just still is addicted to his pacifier. Right man? Um, so I wanted to share like the, his, the story behind him and everything. Um, of course guys you know the story. I'm obsessed with the sculpt. Um, so I originally started painting my own mainly um sculpt and uh I, I it's only my second time painting German vinyl and I was just like flipping out and I was like ah, I'm not gonna finish it so Mimi came available which is my girl Mealy and um I saw her and I've seen quite a bit of them and I was like this one I actually think is really cute so I contacted the artist I bought that one and you know I thought I wouldn't get mine but when I actually saw the baby with paint on it it brought out so many emotions because it looks so much like my real baby. And so um, here's 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 the funny part. My children, when they were younger, they looked so much alike. So I was like, man, I could literally do all my kids just different skin tones, different looks. And so it just kind of been falling that way. Um, so I was inspired to finish my Mealy, um, which is Lulu. You guys haven't seen her, but I've been talking about her. Um, but soon because she's going to get hair. Um, and so, um, but then I was watching, I was watching Joey's work in progress. Look at these little feet, guys. His little feet are so cute. Okay. So I don't want to make him do a lot of squeaking that might bother people, but he doesn't, it's not a screechy sound like I thought it would be that would annoy me. Um, it doesn't bother me actually. And he doesn't actually, it doesn't sound as bad as it does on camera. But anyway, I prefer it because his movement is awesome. But anyway, I would keep saying, but anyway, but anyway. So um, I saw his work in progress pictures and I said, you know, y'all know I have this thing about toddlers not having like a lot of undertones and just, you know, pretty much looking like very pretty dolls. And I saw this when I was like, whoa, I was like, that's some undertone in paint. That's that that artist is doing her thing. And then I was like, kind of like, mm, you know, we have our specific things that we like. And so I was like, it's a lip color. And then I and then I thought about it. My son lips were pretty pinky or whatever. His is not too pink. Actually, they're a very natural color in person. So but I, you know, I tend to paint my baby's lips like darker and stuff like dark colors and stuff like that or whatever. I don't know makes sense but anyway so I, saw, I was just like oh I love him so I was just watching and then he got finished and I said surely because usually they'd be like oh this is not available because it'd be like a custom or something when she said that he was available I just messaged her right away and I was like oh my gosh I was holding my breath for the price and sure enough the price was like up there and I was like I don't care I want him um and I was like I want him I want him and um like the whole transaction because you know in the country that he came from it's just uh they you know it's it's different um and they can't uh accept uh paypal so it was it was it was different and i don't usually pay like that so i was like kind of a little nervous but i knew that you know like kelly maple and uh someone like bunnies reborn or something like that or whatever on instagram there were a few you know people that had actually bought from this artist before but in that amount to have to send it in a way that was kind of like 
not so secure. I was so nervous. Wasn't I nervous? <laughs> and so, what are you looking at? You want to go over there and play? Um, so, I was nervous. But um, the artist was very, 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 very kind through the process. And I was like, listen, however, I just don't want to lose them. Because I at, at this point, like, it was ramping up. I was watching the other posts. People were sharing his posts and stuff. And I was like, oh, my gosh. Because, wait, let's go back. When I saw him and I liked him, I saw another collector post his work in progress picture and I thought she said, my baby. So I was like, oh, okay, that's her baby. So I didn't think he was going to come up for sale. But when he came up for sale, I was like, maybe something fell through or something. I don't know. But I was like, oh. So um, I told her, I said, whatever I got to do. Because they were, you know, you have to pay fees or whatever the way I had to pay. And I was like, I don't care. Because if I keep playing around, somebody going to buy Because I know how people do with me. I have customers that don't have no questions. They just buy. And so I was just like, oh, my God. So we did that. And she was like, rest assured, you know, it, everything's going to be okay. And then, you know, she had to take time to, to, to get them packed up. And I understand that because you would think that we have them ready to go. But usually when we sell them, when we put them up for sale, we're not sure how fast they're going to sell them. Because we're doing so many other things. We just don't get to it. And so, you know, me being anxious because of the way I had to do the transaction, I was just like, oh my God, I gotta wait a few more days before she even put them in the box. But then I just, you know, I calmed my nerves down and mellowed out. And so I, uh, with a good Dolly friend, I was like talking to him. And just FYI, guys, he has on an undershirt under here. Because of the dark color, I don't want nothing to transfer to him. So we being very careful. Mommy is being very careful with him. Um, but anyway... Um, so, <laughs> so we were just like having like stories and stuff and it was funny because, you know, Joe, the movie, this guy, when people do bad things, he get rid of them. So I was like, they better not go bothering him in custom because that's Joe's son. And so I was making jokes up in stories along the way and I was like, oh yeah, one of the male people already went missing. They can't, can't find him because you know how they don't track like the first day. And they can't find the, the male person. And then I was like, well, Joey probably took care of him. He probably was trying to do something bad. And so, um, <laughs> so when he arrived in his box opening and he had the leaf in there, me and my friend was like, uh, we were like, oh, he, um, <laughs> we was like, Joey, done. that's when he got back in the box. It was probably stuck to his shoe. But anyway, he's such a sweet baby. Um. I, he is, he is like so amazing. Okay, and so let me explain something about the weight thing. So I know I made the comment about him not having really hardly no weight in him. He actually feels really nice sitting here on my lap. But, um, so his hair is so soft. Like, this is the best human hair ever. I, um, actually have some here similar and I just talked to my, my rooter about using it. Um, but I don't know if it's this soft, but I'm going to, I think it is, but I'm, it's actually like, it's almost the same curl. So we're gonna, I'm going to see. So Lulu might have similar hair, but I'm not sure yet. But anyway, um, so when I got him out, I was like, I, I knew when I picked up the box that he didn't have much weight because the box wasn't that heavy. But also with bait with the toddlers, you don't weight them as heavy. Now Mimi has good weight and she feels really nice holding, but she doesn't have armatures. But she can still pose like really, really nice the way this sculpt is. They don't really need the armatures unless you want them to like stand and stuff. And but his movement is amazing. And so I think that with the armatures and stuff like that, I don't even know. I don't even think he got weight in his feet. I don't think you have like nothing but like polyfill maybe um but I I think that they do the weight really light in them so that they can stand and move very fluid and it it definitely makes sense his movement is amazing um so I I definitely would don't mind I wouldn't change his weight or anything um uh, because I, it's not that I would be holding him like a whole lot. Mm. Oh my gosh. <laughs> like I just want to just like scream. I just can't believe how real he looks and how 
he made it here. He's so, so amazing. It's so amazing. I love, 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 love when artists paint this way. Like, I paint my babies um, with a lot of detail in their coloring, too. So, I love a very colorful, detailed baby. And this, this, this is... This is, this is nice. Um, he's not like overly done. He's like just perfect. So anyway, so I'm tracking him and then he, his tracking like stops. Like, you know how it just sits. And then he, um, he actually got here really fast. Um, I don't know. Was it a week or two weeks? I don't know. Because it, she took a couple days before she actually shipped him and then but when she shipped him it didn't take as long and what happened is he showed up in Miami and I was like okay you going down to the visit Auntie Clara <laughs> and so um <laughs> uh so anyway he uh I, he was like down in Miami and then you know, he said it said he made it through customs and everything, and then it was like he's trans to his look his destination. So I was like, you know, I don't know. I know with UPS they usually get there in like a day, get here like in a day from from Miami, but um, not with USPS. So I was like, well, he'll be here in a couple days, right? So it was never like no update, and so I was what was I doing? I was working, and. Um, I had an appointment and I had to go outside the house. Um, and so I was trying to get ready and I, I was in a group text. And so, you know, the texts were coming in. So I didn't think it was, you know, anything but my family just texting. And so I just ignored the text for a while while I finished doing what I was doing. And next thing I know, I, I went to check. I was like, let me see what my mom said. And then it said deliver. Like, it went from, I'm in Miami, I'm leaving Miami the night before, or the day before, but it was, like, early in the morning, like, 7 a.m., and then it was, like, I'm in, it was, like, delivered. I was thinking, like, he would get here, like, in a couple days or so, like, so I was, like, and it was early, it was in the morning, but I had, like I said, I had stuff I had to do, and I couldn't put it off, so it was so hard, not just dropping it i wanted to cancel everything but i couldn't cancel that meeting and stuff so i had to 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 go and um yeah so it was just amazing to get him and i was like i don't have time to be trying to make no area for him in the nursery i just said you know what about that he will be getting what is it uh Okay, I was like, he will, he will be, uh, I'm just gonna stop right here in the, the hall area in my stairwell. I, that's where I took the box opening. And then it sucked because it was like raining anyway. So it was like really dark. So no sunlight really coming in. But anyway, say I made it and I am amazing. My mommy loves me. I didn't even look at his eyelashes really too much, but they are amazing. They are long and he, I love that, I love these babies because they like turn their heads all different ways. And so, he doesn't have armatures in his arms, um, in his hands per se, but, um, this sculpt, because it's on like the strings and stuff, it, it allows them to have like circular motion with their arms and stuff. And already and then the fact that he has the armatures in his little custom body he is so sweet like he is just like the perfect baby you're the perfect one Joey so I just thought I would come on look at this look at this little boy say we would come on and we would talk to you guys you don't want to look at them and also his eye color so I didn't, I thought his eyes was like just a regular brown in purse in um, the, uh, in the photos, but he has like, I don't know how to explain it. Like it's like a, I don't know if that's what you call it, like a hazel, no, it's not a hazel, it's like a, 
it's like a greenish brown it's really really a really weird like color not weird but i don't know how to explain it but my first daughter when she was first first born her eyes was like more like this color and they eventually turned to a very very light brown um audrey's mom and then my first daughter and my son they looked identical as babies but his eyes were light but not as light as hers but like his eye color is perfect and um so like i said my kids looked alike so it's just like it feels like i'm like oh my god this is my son and y'all don't hate me for this but i moved phoenix so fast i was like oh my gosh i'm like phoenix i don't know if i love you as much as i love him anymore oh my gosh i'm like please give me a couple more days i can't treat phoenix like this so i put phoenix on my bed and when I went to walk by the room, his head was dropped like this. And I was like, oh my God, he's sad. It's so crazy how we, we go crazy with these babies and the emotions and the, the personalities that we give them and they take on. What do you want? You want, to, you want the video to end? <laughs> so, oh my gosh, guys, I am so happy like right now. Um, so yeah, so I, I trusted the process and i am so happy i don't know that i would do it again but maybe um i'm just i'm, I'm so i'm so happy to have him and i was actually supposed to be sharing um my new baby that i painted well i have quite a bit of babies here that i have been working on but i haven't shared them because i was hoping to get them here first <sighs> but that's gonna they're not gonna get here until next year so i was like oh, maybe i'll show a couple of them so i'm kind of gonna start easing them out throughout the next couple months um but um i will share her i will share his night night routine and everything right because it's gonna be like a long day but i thought i'd do a follow-up video with him um today and and do this video first and then I'll I'll upload the rest. So guys, stay tuned. I promise I'll give you a lot of people been messaging me about the baby that the one that I painted. I will be giving lots of details on it. But I would definitely his hair seems to be human hair. It is all human. But even his baby edges lay down like as if it was mohair. Like he's amazing. Um his eyebrows are painted amazingly. Um yeah so it's there is a lot of little similarities to how i paint my babies but the finish is different on him and hands down i i will i will say that i think this artist skills with the coloring is really nice and um definitely 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 worth it because like i said i i prefer to buy babies that i feel like i may or may not be able to quite achieve and the way that she put him together as far as his coloring his armatures everything his eye color his eyebrows everything about him is just flawless and she is definitely on a different level <laughs> <laughs> love 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 him so he, i i actually also before he came i actually shopped for him so he has like a box full of clothes the only thing i didn't have was shoes and so he came with a bunch of shoes so he doesn't need shoes right now um maybe a pair of hard bottoms that i was gonna get out uh, his bells came um but yeah he is he's already ready so like his little pjs little outfit that he had on yesterday he has like you know, I like my babies in PJs, but I am going to put him on clothes and shoes so that he can stand up and we can get some photos and we can do some role play with him. But, um, and I also want to say, and I know this is a long video and a lot of people probably didn't even make it to the end, but I also want to say that the other, um, collective moms that has Valera babies, uh, reborns, um, how, was really nice. They were like, welcome to the Valera baby family. I'm like, yeah. I have extended family here. So, 
he will definitely be a big part of my channel guys and you guys know typically if i don't paint the baby i don't typically have them on my channel a whole lot because i don't want people to be confused as to who i painted who i didn't paint and then plus i always try to make it all about me but this little guy will definitely be be all over oh my god his eyes just he just turned his eyes did y'all see that oh he not cl up close you guys can't see him his eyes his eyes literally just shift he's real i knew he was real i knew he was a real boy oh my gosh and he does um you guys couldn't see this in his pictures but he does have like some veining and everything like he's he's really nice you're nice baby say yes i'm nice just don't turn out to be like your father Okay, we are going. We are going, right? Okay, his little tummy feel like it feel. I keep doing this because it feel like he like his tummy is feels real, the way it push out a little bit. Okay, we're going. So we're going. We're going. We're going. We're going. We're going. We're going. Let's see if we can get a little closer before we go. See. <gasps> Say hello. I didn't miss him with his little binky. He looks so cute with his binky. I love it with his binky. I love it with his binky, binky, binky. Okay, we're done. <laughs> oh, one last thing. His, his artist pictures, definitely not edited. I mean, not to a point where it takes away like his color and his detail. He, she actually, the baby actually looked like her photos, which is phenomenal. Thank you. <laughs>